we will discuss here synchronous speed. What is synchronous speed? In AC machines, like induction motor, synchronous motor, and synchronous generator, there is a rotating magnetic field built up in the stator winding. The physical speed of rotation of rotating magnetic field is called synchronous speed. It depends upon supply frequency and number of poles in the stator. The equation of the synchronous speed is given as n suffix s equals to 120 f by p, where f is frequency, p is number of poles, and n suffix s is synchronous speed in RPM. Let us establish the formula of synchronous speed. Before establishing the formula of synchronous speed, let us examine what does happen if we supply an alternating current to an electromagnet. An electromagnet has obviously two magnetic poles physically 180 degree apart from each other. Due to applied alternating current, the polarity of the magnet continuously alters along with the alteration of current through the coil of the magnet. We all know that frequency F means cycles per second. Then, time required for one cycle is 1 by F second. It is called time period and denoted by capital T. Therefore, capital T equals 1 by F. Then half the period is T by 2 equals 1 by 2 F. Therefore, we can say, the polarity of any pole of the magnet alters in every 1 by 2 f second. As the poles of the magnet are physically 180 degree apart from each other, the polarities of magnetic field rotate 180 degree in 1 by 2 f second. Therefore, it takes, 2 by 2 f second to complete a revolution of 360 degree. Now, instead of two poles, the magnetic system has four poles symmetrically apart from each other. Then, one pole is 90 degree apart from its adjacent pole. If the supply frequency is still same, any two adjacent poles alter their polarity in same 1 by 2 f second. In that case, the magnetic field takes same 1 by 2 f seconds to propagate physically 90 degree. So, it takes 4 into 1 by 2 f, or 4 by 2 f second to complete one physical rotation of 360 degree. Similarly, we can prove that, if there was p numbers of poles in the system, the magnetic field takes p by 2 f seconds to complete the entire 360 degree rotation. That means, in p by 2 f seconds, it revolves one revolution. Therefore, in one second, it revolves 2 f by p revolution. So, in one minute, or 60 seconds it revolves 120 f by p. As per definition, it is synchronous speed. So we can write, n suffix s equals to 120 f by p. Hope you got an idea. Thank you.